This video is for anyone that wants to send the same OBS signal to multiple different platforms at the same time, aka multi-streaming. And also, if you're a Twitch user, I'm going to show you how you can do shared chat to maximize your collaboration with your fellow streamers. If you're new to the channel, my name is Becky Safe, and if you're not new, welcome back. I know it's been a while, but I am back and I'm here to create more how-to tutorial videos for you. I've also now added channel members so if you'd like to join the channel, help support and also get exclusive access to Twitch VODs, discounts for my courses and any other exclusive bits that I sneak in there in advance of releasing them to the public. Join the channel now, there's I think four or five different levels. Pick the one you like and thank you for your support. Right, let's jump into the video. So the first thing that you're going to do is download Atom Multistream. So I'll leave a link for this below the video, uh, but if you go to atom.tv, go to products and go down to multi-stream and then download multi for free. Once you've downloaded and installed it, open up OBS and it should be in the docs. So go to the docs, come down and you have Atom Multistream and you can place this anywhere on your OBS layout. I preferably like to have it next to the main streaming controls. I'll tell you why in a moment. This is Atom Multistream. It allows you to stream to other platforms, not just Twitch. In order to do that, you want to click on the cog and go to main canvas and go to add output. And you can see there's multiple different platforms that you can stream to using the same OBS. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stream to Twitch. So we're already streaming to Twitch using this OBS, but we're going to stream to another Twitch channel. And I do this on my DJ streams. So when I have friends that come over and we all do a back to back together and we all have our individual channels, I will add in their stream keys into my OBS and then hit start streaming using the same OBS. And it sends the same signal to all of our different channels which is really great because each of our respective communities can now see us all DJing together in one spot. I'm going to show you how to do this using my second channel because I have a DJ channel and I have an IRL channel, Becky Safe IRL, which I'm probably going to be streaming on a lot more. Uh, Twitch server, default, just leave it as default. Twitch stream key. So this is where you would need to get your stream key from your friends or your different stream keys for your different platforms. So in this instance, you're going to go to your Twitch creator dashboard. You're going to come down to settings, stream and copy your stream key. Come back into Atom Multistream, paste your stream key, create output, hit OK. And now you have your second stream in Atom Multistream. Now, you can't hit go live on this stream. If you press go live here, you get this error message that comes up, unable to start output. The reason being is because you need to do a native OBS start streaming before you can send the signal to your other stream keys. So you, I'm not gonna do it cause I'm not gonna go live, but you'd hit start streaming and then you would hit go live one by one on all of your different platforms. And you can have many in here. So say you have five friends over, you could have five different stream keys in there and you just hit go live on all of them. And then whatever is in your OBS will be sent to all of the different channels. Now, going back to Twitch, if you're collaborating with your friends in the same location using one OBS and you're using Atom Multistream to send the stream to multiple different channels, well, you can also maximize your content by using shared chat. Now, shared chat is a little bit janky. So I generally tend to use it just just to share the chat and not all of the other features. And you don't really need to use all of the other features if you're using Atom Multistream. Come into your creator dashboard, scroll down, do stream together, start stream together. And now this window pops up and you need to get your friends in this window. And in order to do that, you would invite guests. So down here are suggested people to invite. You can also type the user's name in the top, click on their name and then click send invite. That invite will go into the top right corner, the notifications of the person that you're inviting. So make sure that you tell them to look out for a notification in the top part here. It will say, Becky has invited you to start sharing chat. You need to both have stream together open. So both have this open. Your friend will then pop up in this window. And because you're only using this to share the Twitch chat, you can just mute 
the microphone and the speaker. You're not going to see the shared chat option immediately. The steps that you need to do and in this order if you're going to do the whole setup would be to hit start streaming to go live natively, then hit go live on all of your other Atom multi-stream channels, then once you're live on everybody's channel, Twitch will detect that everybody has gone live and then you jump back into your stream together and it will ask you, do you want to start sharing chat? And you say yes. It'll also say this in your individual Twitch chats and as long as somebody hits yes at some point, you'll start sharing chat. Now, one thing I have noticed is if you press X on this window and you come out of streaming together, it will stop sharing the chat for you and you need to re-enable that. Now, before I I run away please hit the like drop a comment and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more videos from me also atom multi-stream you don't just have the option of sharing to a horizontal canvas you can also share to a vertical canvas so maybe you're looking to send your obs signal to other platforms including TikTok, which is a vertical platform where you can create a vertical canvas. There's a few different things that you need to know about setting up for TikTok, but you can stream your same stream from OBS to Twitch, to YouTube and to TikTok at the same time using Atom Multistream. And I'll show you how to do that in the next video. Click on it. Click it. Click on it and subscribe to the channel and join. Join the channel. Support me, please. Support me. Love you. Click it. Click it. You know you want to. You want to stream vertically. Learn it from me. <laughs> Bye.